What's up, YouTube, and welcome back to my Anno 1800 Let's Play series. So this will be the last episode of the Let's Play because I've really accomplished everything I wanted to accomplish, and the rest of the things are a little nitpicky. Like, so as you can see, this is my half, uh, my half attempt at the palace. Uh, I didn't have quite enough uh, materials to finish this out. And I think it's a little bit big anyway. The plan was to surround the scholars with the palace. But obviously that didn't work out as I hoped. But I could make this a little smaller and just kind of complete it that way. But, uh, you know, I didn't um, I didn't really consider it. I didn't think about it well. And the next Let's Play, I think I want to put like the palace like right in the middle of everything. And then put the scholars kind of within like the little... You know, the little compound and then have people kind of on the outside with roads coming in the gates and all that stuff. I think that'll that'll happen on the next Let's Play. Um, and that being said, I do want to have the next Let's Play be a, a campaign, a campaign mode, expert mode, campaign mode playthrough. Because I haven't played the campaign in such a long time. And um, when I did play it, I was, I was much more of a newbie and I really had no idea what was going on with the game and... I just I, I was like constantly um, I don't know I was constantly negative in the in like negative balance and I was constantly just running out of money here and there and I didn't know how to fulfill my needs and supply chain trade routes were all screwed up and man it was a mess so I wanted to do uh, well one of two things I want to do a campaign mode let's play of this on expert or I want to do an expert sort of um, sort of stranded sort of uh, sort of prisoner kind of challenge and that that would be uh Navarius has done this already and i think it's like it seems like a pretty challenging run and like a pretty rewarding one as well is that you you have uh three level three ai you're on expert mode and you are just you start out on this island with the trade post already built and you don't have access to any ships you start with no ships you start with a small capital you have low influence low income and you're basically just doing your best to build up to a um, basically to the point where you can get ships and start to quest, start to do trading, and just kind of expand your empire. It, it's just things are a lot slower in that, just in that respect that you don't really have access to the funds that you would normally have right away. Um, so, so those are the two options I think that would be that I that I'm really interested in doing. And if you guys are interested in seeing that, let me know. I think. Uh, just let me know in the comments what you think. Um, I would be, I would be pretty excited, pretty stoked about doing one of those two things. Um, but I do have after this episode, I'm thinking about maybe coming up with a few guides or, or just going straight into the next let's play. I don't know. You know, I'm kind of, I'm kind of in between on it. But I was wondering what what you guys actually want to see because I mean, this channel, like, this channel is not just like it's not just me posting content and talking to you. It's like. It's you guys, you know, it's, it's, um, it's like, you know, what you guys want to see played too. Cause you know, like the support from you guys really, really makes, makes my channel and makes it, makes it worth it to me to, to post this because I'll tell you what, like I see comments, um, you know, when I see comments from people about how my videos have helped them, like, that's like the best feeling in the world to me. Like it may, it makes, it makes all this worth it just to, just to know that I was able to help in some way, you know? Because because I love gaming and if I can help somebody in their gaming experience, like that's that's like the one of the top, um, you know, that's like one of the one of the top level most valuable, you know, um, feelings for me is that you know being able to help somebody in in their in their experience that is my hobby and hopefully more than a hobby someday, but help somebody in in their hobbies, you know, it feels really good, and I'm I'm glad that I can explain stuff pretty well to you guys and. You know, just uh, just taking it slow. Um, there are some games that I play that that aren't aren't so slow paced, but but this to me is like relaxing and rewarding. It's not stressful, you know. Like like League of Legends, I feel like is pretty stressful and it can be pretty toxic sometimes. And you know, Escape from Tarkov can be pretty uh, <laughs> pretty adrenaline pumping, and and you know that can be kind of toxic at times too. But Anno is just so relaxing, beautiful. The music uh, is great. Just the ambience in general, everything's pretty good about it. You know, like Anno is just a great game. Um, oh, and by the way, just the population is, we have almost 90,000 people. So that's kind of nice. Um, 
But anyway, so this Let's Play, we've accomplished pretty much everything that we want to accomplish. You know, like Crown Falls. I mean, I have, so I've met all the investor needs, right? Um, the uh, the basic needs are all met. I mean, of course, you know, some supply chain issues, but I've been all through all these supply chains, which I've never done before, by the way. Um, I've been through all the happiness uh, supply chains as well, which I've never done before either. And uh, so investors, you know, those are good to go. Um, and we go to Ambessa, and I've actually never done the like played out the Ambessa campaign as much as I have before. Um, so Katima just keeps talking, and it's kind of bothering me. Um, and uh, and the elders, like I've been through all these supply chains, um, and not the clay pipes is the only one I haven't touched on yet with elders. Um, but other than that, Ambessa has pretty much done. You know, Ambessa's done, the Arctic is done. Um, actually, let's check on the Arctic, because they're miserable, like always. Um, so, so the technicians, I've done all their happiness stuff, and only thing I haven't done is husky sleds. But I'm not too, like, well, I'm just not too worried about that, right? Like, like the Arctic, I'm debating whether I want this DLC in my next Let's Play or not. I really don't know if I should. Um... And Ambessa, I'm not sure about that either. Like, I, I do think the research and everything is pretty cool. And the buildings and everything. The atmosphere is really great. But my goodness, I, I think the the questing is ridiculous. And I wish there was a way to um, to just deactivate the quests. You know, I like, I want to come to Ambessa. I want to experience this, this um, instance, this DLC. But I do not want to, to do these quests. There's just so many. So much clicking and so much so much looking and craziness. I, I just I don't want to deal with it. Um, and same, well, Cape Trelawney is really not that bad. Cape Trelawney is actually fun. Like the the questing in this one's fun. Um, and uh, yeah, yeah. So so if I do the campaign next, I'm thinking that I I will you know really really play out both of the islands. Um, well, the islands that you that the island that you start with the ditch water, and then there's other islands that you acquire later. Um, and you know, either by your own expansion or through the campaign that I just want to really max out like, you know, all the way. And what I'll do is kind of set goals for each episode. And I, I think I want the episodes to be a little shorter too for that campaign, but, um, yeah, Hey, your input's really appreciated. Um, anything that you have, anything that you want to see on this channel too, let me know. It doesn't have to be just Anno, but, um, anything you want to see, just let me know. Also, um, I just hit 180 subscribers as of this morning, and I wanted to say thank you so much for that. I really, really appreciate the support that you guys have. Uh, actually, let's get it. Let's get a police station here to fix this. Fix this. Um, but yeah, the support from for the support from you guys from the community has been really, really great, and I really, truly am appreciative of the subscriptions, the comments. Like I said, like I said, the comments uh, really make my day, and. I really, really, truly do appreciate you guys commenting on my videos. I really do. It means so much to see that I'm helping somebody, you know? So, um, so yeah, uh, we do have some police here, I think. Oh, I'll make another one anyway. Doesn't matter. Um, but yeah, so, so I think this, uh, this Let's Play will actually be, um, the reference one I use for a lot of my guides. So... Yeah, so I'll, I'll keep this save around for sure. Um, and I don't remember the seed. I've had a couple of people ask me for the seed, and I don't know exactly which one it is. But um, yeah, so so hey guys, thanks thanks for tuning in to the, my Let's Play series. Thanks for all your support. I mean, I think this series is has run like, you know, like 46 videos, 47 videos long. And each of them are like an hour plus, you know, long. So that's like... I mean, you know, that's like total, like almost 50 hours of content um, that I've put out, you know, and that that I've enjoyed making every single minute. I've enjoyed every single minute of it. You know, it's been really good. So, so I think I think overall it's been a success. Like you guys have been great, and I've really enjoyed the people that have joined for the journey. And um, yeah, so so with that, uh, I will go ahead and say that. In the old world, oh sorry, in Cape Trelawney, um, the palace. I just wanted to add a couple things before I before I uh, get off here. Um, 
and that is that is the palace. I really want to make this a goal of the next Let's Play. I really want to make the palace um, and the Docklands and all that really come together for the attractiveness of um, of Ditchwater. I want to make Ditchwater more than just Ditchwater. I want to have, make it an attractive, beautiful looking place. And I want to have a setup kind of like this in Ditchwater, you know, where I have all the investors kind of lined up on the side and then, you know, like some attractions, the World Fair, all that stuff. I really want the campaign to play through nicely. Um, but it will be on expert. Um, I don't think it, it's like it's not going to be like a survival sort of deal where where I can't move like the buildings and where I can't like where everything's just low, low, low and takes forever to get going. Like I want the campaign to play out, you know, pretty um, relatively smoothly, although there will be level three AI. So there probably will be some war. I, I won't deny that um, there will probably be war, but um, I'm not too worried about that. Unless you guys want to see war, then then I don't know, you know, then then I can probably do a couple level one AI or something. But um, yeah. So this has been really fun, guys. This has been really fun. I've had a lot of cool items come through. A lot of um, I've just learned a lot. I've never progressed this far in Anno before until I did this Let's Play, and uh, playing with you guys has been the best part. It really has. So um, with that. I will catch you on the next video, the next guide that I do, or um, just the beginning of the next Let's Play, which will probably be pretty soon. So with that, I will catch you on the next one. Take care.